Hi there, lovely, and welcome to my page. I'm Rhonda Crimes, and I am a certified life and leadership coach and trainer for everyday women just like you who are tired of being undervalued, people-pleasing good girls, or who I prefer to call super givers. So first off, let me just say, I know it's been a while since I've chatted with you. And I hope that you will understand that while I am a coach, I'm also human and I have peaks and troughs in my life too. And the past several months across a couple of life areas have been more troughy than peaky for me. Now, I'm not going to go into all the gory details here, but suffice to say that I've done a lot of behind the scenes introspection about my business and how I want to show up across the different platforms and price points. I want it to be in a way that sits well with my values and is sustainable long term for both me and the gorgeous gals in my community. Also, in a way that lessens the degree of impact the algorithms and the trolls inside some of these platforms have upon me and my business. So, you will likely notice a number of changes in the coming months as I come into what I'm calling my renaissance. The definition of which that I am using is the activity spirit or time of great rebirth, revival or rediscovery immediately following the Middle Ages across cultural, artistic, political and economic interests. I am on the other side of my own Middle Ages and I have never really done a word for the year before. But this one popped into my head and I kind of like it. Thank you, Sorceress. What I also want to make known is who I really serve and why. So I invite you to imagine a world where beautiful people-pleasing good girls or super givers can use their voice, make their stand and live their life their way with compassion, courage and curiosity and not feel guilty about it. We have been raised to comply, oblige and behave appropriately to be good and stay small, be quiet and stay in the background. Be helpful and stay in our place. Be pleasant. And whatever happens, don't make waves. <laughs> it's not hard to come to believe that this is as good as it gets for us. To believe that change is hard, uncomfortable and confrontational. That choosing otherwise will be disrespectful and by cultural default, you must choose to be seen as a good girl or wear the shameful badge of being a bad girl. <laughs> you know, I call bullshit on all of that. I believe that living with a servant heart in honour of collaboration and cooperation is a beautiful place to come from. Whereas living in servitude in response to domination and the hierarchical oppression of an outdated cultural paradigm is intolerable, exhausting and must change. And that's why after decades of being the person others felt attracted and often compelled to sharing their stories without invitation, I formalised my innate skill set and trained to become a certified coach and trainer. And I am now freshly launching truly coaching, training and mentoring with Rhonda. My business exists to create and offer one-to-one -one and group coaching, training and mentoring opportunities to guide and support everyday people pleasing good girls or super givers to curiously explore what is most important for them to stand for, to compassionately encourage them to speak their truth and to courageously live their life aligned to their heart's desire with confidence and without guilt. 
I look forward to rolling out the changes and sharing the wisdom I've gathered for nearly six decades around the sun and, of course, serving directly from my heart to yours. Much love. <laughs>